hello everyone welcome to another video of Midas quick learning series so here we will be talking about SPC tool that is provided in Midas civil to define these kind of irregular section as you can see in my window so as of now we are having a DXF file for a steel girder for which you can see the deck is of irregular width on the either side so suppose you are having any kind of DXF file with these sections then you can import it in SPC and then you can further work on that so as of now I am using Midas CAD where this file is being displayed and now I'll quickly open my SPC so we go under the tools and then here we are having the SPC select the units click on OK so yeah this is our SPC tool and from now on we will import the file for us using file import AutoCAD DXF so I'm just selecting my DXF file with that irregular section and this has been imported and now we will further work on this first we will define the material properties so for that we go under model and click on material click on add give the name for our material and the properties this is provided click on apply and second material will be concrete as our deck will be of concrete material click on ok So material has been defined next we need to create a section for that we'll just generate a composite section with the name as steel girder number of parts will be two base material will be steel after that so we can see in the message window that the composite section has been created for us next we will add part for this composite section for that I go under the section composite section and click on add part so we since this is a two part composite section part one will be for the girder and second will be for the deck we need to add those parts so all the line consisting of part one has been selected click on apply similarly select part id as to give the name as deck material will be concrete and we will select all the lines consisting of part 2 I can change the color from here for ease of interpretation now we will calculate the composite property and I am giving the mesh size as 100 mm hit apply so the properties are calculated you can see those in the tables for the deck girder and the combined properties now we just need to extract this section so we will export give a name select the section hit apply so our section has been imported now we will go to section properties and we will import the section that has been defined for another composite general I can uh, import SEC files so I have defined this section give the name here you can see the part wise and total properties I am changing the offset as center top And suppose we want to use this section at the extreme right girder where we might have a increased width of the deck so I'll just show this to you that how do we assign these irregular sections so I'll just drag and drop when you check on the hidden mode so you can see the irregular section 
with different deck width has been considered. So that was the use of SPC. I believe many of the people wonder how do we define irregular section. So that is why we chose this topic to elaborate. Hope this was helpful for you. Thank you.